Actually, that snow is from the same system that's impacting us this morning. So we made a flip over in Worcester. Now we're back to rain. It's mainly rain for most of us, but it is going to be a slow go this morning as you're stepping out early, especially if you're heading out right now. Look at the radar. We have areas of moderate to heavy rain across southern New England. The heaviest focus, you'll notice, south of Boston, back down to Cape Cod, where the temperatures are in the upper 30s to low 40s right now. The deeper yellows and oranges, those are the heavier elements of rain pouring right now from Chatham back up to Truro. Nantucket letting up just a little bit compared to what you had about a half hour ago. Heavy rain pouring from Edgartown, stretching back up to Woods Hole. Still some heavy downpours on the south shore from Plymouth to Marshfield, back up to Wayne. Down towards Brockton and Randolph into the city of Boston. Let's up a little bit, 128 to 495, but it's still steady. Wipers on all the way into southern New Hampshire with a few flakes that may be mixing in here when you get from Lemonster back up along the Route 2 corridor and over the border into New Hampshire. But there's going to be no impact there with the road temperatures warm enough. Uh, obviously, that we're above freezing. So any kind of talk of the snow this morning will be just that talk as areas of rain wrap up between about 7 and 9 a.m. So it's in and out of here pretty quickly. Just poor timing for the commute. Rapid clearing comes in and the sun breaks out by late morning and midday. The bigger story later on is going to be the wind. We have a wind advisory up until 1 this afternoon on Nantucket for gusts to 50 miles per hour and sustained winds 25 to 35. For the rest of us, it's a wind advisory this afternoon from 2 to 9 p.m., gusts 40 to 50 miles per hour. This will result in some pockets of wind damage and um, obviously some limbs and maybe some outages in spots with a few isolated gusts that may top out over 50 in the hilly terrain of central Massachusetts. So the wind whips up, temperatures go up. 60 to 64 for many of us, so a totally changeable day. We turn warm 50s along the south coast to Cape Cod. Clear skies tonight. 28 to 35 in the suburbs, 37 in Boston. Tomorrow will be a cooler day overall, but pretty normal for this time of the year. Upper 40s to around 50 for most of us with sunshine and a few clouds that mix in in the afternoon. Weak high pressure and control. That high will slide off the coastline. So Friday, our next disturbance comes in. Clouds will thicken Friday morning to midday and a little burst of wintry mix. Friday, late in the day, will change over to rain. That's warmer air pushing in, but it does look like it rains steadily for Friday evening and night, and there may be a lingering shower early on Saturday. Because of that, moving in on Friday, wind off the ocean too, 45 to 50. So it will be a bit of a cooler end to the week on Friday after highs in the 60s today. But we're back up into the 60s for the weekend, and it's looking mainly dry as well. Could be an early morning shower on Saturday. Cooler at the coast, especially on Sunday, and it looks like another round of showers will come in as we head into the start of next week.